a lot of people are saying I look, sound, acted, and did flips just like Miles Morales. So a lot of people are saying that there's there's not a better real life adaptation of this character than me. I mean, that's that's what y'all are saying. You know, what I mean, I'm I'm not the one saying that. You know what I mean? But like from my seat and literally millions of other people's seats, mm -hmm. you are already Miles Morales. <laughs> so this is how I became known as the real life Miles Morales. So basically this whole thing dates back to December of 2021 where this guy Soups posted a video that they were potentially going to be making a real life Miles Morales live action film. Miles Morales might be coming to the MCU and it's sooner than you think. And then out of nowhere my comments were just being filled, filled, filled. Like I was getting tagged in this video at least five to three hundred times a day. Like it was absolutely nuts. I was getting tagged in this man's comment sections more than anything possible. Shout out to you guys that I am who I am right now. The cops are, literally while filming this, the cops are like pulling somebody over or something. Hold on. Only in Atlanta. It's because of you guys that I am where I am right now. Yeah, we go back to 2021. I kind of started this massive, massive trend, gaining millions and millions of views, millions and millions of likes, and a lot of attention from different people, obviously Marvel fans. With this came the good, and the bad. This thing is super wet, so I'm just gonna use my sweater to sit on so I can get a better view of you. With all that came the pros and the cons. There was a lot more attention. Some of the pros, I was getting a lot, lot, lot more attention than I was before. I went from four million followers to five million followers in the course of like two and a half months, just of people rooting for me to become Miles Morales. So with all this new and found attention that I was getting, I decided to make my first video. All I gotta do now is gain some hype and show everyone that I can do this. Like, I'll put my hair back in an afro, I don't care. I also may or may not have ordered a Miles Morales suit. I mean, all this point, what I'll be- What are you doing? Nothing? A lot of people are saying that, hey, you don't even look like Miles Morales. So then I made this video, and this video absolutely blew up. I got a lot of new attention saying that I look like Miles Morales. You probably can't see it right now because I have my twist and everything in, but if you look at this picture and look at this picture, and it looks like millions of people agreed with it as well. Okay, but then with all that, people were saying that, yeah, you look like Miles Morales, but he's Spider-Man. You don't do anything Spider-Man-like. So then becomes the Miles Morales stunting chapter, where I'm doing all these stunts in my Miles Morales suits, and not only am I doing flips in a Miles Morales costume, but I copy Miles Morales' style I copy Miles Morales' style clip by clip, book by book, to the perfection of the pixel and bring it to the real life adaptation. You know, I, I embrace his movements, but in real life. Yeah. Okay, and then with all that being said, people are like, yeah, you look like him, you can do the stunts, but you can't act. You can't act, you can't act, you can't act. And now hear me out, hear me out. At the time, I was not the best actor. Put a stop to Craven before it hurts anybody else. <laughs> <laughs> Action. So that's how I got here. I thought that was for no, it was good. So that's how I got here? Some sort of multiverse. So, th wait, wait, wait. Two scene, take 13. Action. So that's how I got here? Wait. <laughs> okay, I can't act. So when I'm my way, did a little bit of acting here and there, stepped my foot in. The person who was meant to play Miles Morales is an unknown actor, but he's not on your fan casting list. <laughs> Got the basics, and now even to this day, I'm chasing acting and becoming a better actor so that I can portray this role and portray this, uh, 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 you know, portray this Spider-Man thing hopefully in the future someday. I'm still pushing it two years later. I started acting more. I got on a TV show. I got my own scenes in some shows. I did my own stunts. You know, I did this, I did that. And after all that, I've gotten absolutely nothing but positive feedback now that I've been working on myself and working on my acting and working on a lot of my skills. And I took it so seriously that I moved all the way from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, down to Atlanta, Georgia. I moved all the way down to Atlanta, Georgia to portray my acting and stunting career to hopefully become uh, a better version of myself. If I can't get the Miles and Miles role, then hopefully I can just become a actor and stuntman because I do want to do something other than just parkour. Because I don't want to do parkour all the time. 
Now, with all that being said, you could also argue that I wouldn't even have to be that great at acting, because apparently I've been told that I act just like Miles Morales just in my everyday life. Well, that's the crazy thing about it is, yeah, yes, you're, you're absolutely correct in the sense that for a major motion picture, and really any motion picture, mm -hmm. there is a certain level of talent and skill and expertise you need in acting, mm -hmm. but you're you're largely playing yourself in a that's sense. So, so it's like, it's not just like, hey, I want to become an actor and learn how to play this character. Mm -hmm. It's like, I already feel like this character. If I just act like me, how I always do, then maybe I can portray this character a little bit more, you know what I mean? What is going on? The ops are opping tonight. Huh. You can, you can also argue that I would just have to act like myself in these films just because a lot of people are saying I sound, look, act, blah, 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 like Miles Morales. And not only that, but my signature hero flip that I do is actually Miles Morales' signature leap of faith flip. And it's absolutely insane. Now, every time I go around somewhere in public, I'm just called Miles Morales. People don't even recognize me as Hero DW anymore. I get recognized as Miles Morales. So honestly, would I even have to be that great of an actor? Would I have to be a Will Smith? Do I have to be the Michael B. Jordan? Or would I just have to be me? And just because of that, this video is not sponsored, but it's sponsored by me. I'm going to let y'all know, I'm about to be dropping merch soon for the first time ever. Y'all are the first people to hear this. I'm going to be dropping merch for the first first time officially ever. And it will be the Leap of Faith merch. This is one of the first products. This is one of the first designs you guys are going to see. Let me know how you guys feel about that.